Hello, Ilona. Hello, Buena Aaron. It's been a long, long time. How are you feeling, first of all? I'm still here. <laughs> For people who don't know who Ilona is, who are you exactly? Well, I'm an artist, and late in my life I started to perform, and I loved it. I know it's rude to ask, but I have to. How old are you, Ilona? I just became 100 years in March. 100 years and old? 100. Can you still kick your leg up? One moment. And in the very end, I wrote, I decided, whatever I feel, I like to share with people because other people must feel very similar. What is the book called? The book has a very funny title. 99, straight up, no tracer. Here I am. <laughs> Many people have the same problems and the same fears and go through things which are very similar. And if I can share what I feel with them, they might feel better. One thing I always loved about you is yep. you are a very fashionable person. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I was in Myrtle Beach where I was teaching at the time. And I, a friend of mine was throwing things out or giving it for yard sale. And there was a desk set. This is where the letters were put in. And I took it home, she gave it to me, and I took it apart, and it's my favorite bracelet. I love it. I do too. <laughs> you love color, right? Don't you love color? And I love color, yeah. Color can cheer you up when you feel very lousy. Instead of wearing dark colors and black, wear something colorful, it cheers your spirit. Hold on, don't go, don't go anywhere, okay, Alana? Hold on one second. I needed a pop of color. Sorry, I'm back. Are you still performing? Anytime I have a friend come here who is very depressed, you can be sure I'll, leave, I'll perform. Can you can you give us some some Edith Piaf? Quand il me prend dans ses bras et il me parle tout bas, je vois la vie en rose. You lived such an amazing life, and people are very scared right now. I know. What do you tell, what would you tell them to make them feel better? This is not the first time that things happen which are terrible. And it won't be the last one, unfortunately. And what we have to do is look what we've got and make the most of it. And feel more peaceful and don't feel influenced by people who who are terrified and tell us horror stories. Like the philosopher says, this too shall pass. But whatever we have, we have to. Very important things are having good friends, somebody to talk to. It's a little thing, but it makes people happy. And it's really much about making another person happy. That's how I feel anyhow. I'm in love again, and the spring is coming. And she spent a hundred years making other people happy. So I'm glad you got a chance to meet my good friend Alona. Her book, 99 Straight Up No Chaser, is available now. And um, fun fact, Alona, I told my best friend at my bachelor party, I was like, I don't want typical entertainment, if you know what I mean, at my bachelor party. So he's like, okay. So he actually brought in Alona and she sang in, uh, came in and sang. Oh my gosh. Off and did cabaret. There's a woman she who, did at, cabaret? who at 98 years old, <laughs> She did cabaret at my bachelor party, so it was just her and like 25 dudes like, yeah, and this 96-year-old woman at the time singing cabaret. So she's Funny. she's so special. And, That's and like amazing. She, she was in a fourth floor walk up for forever, and now she moved to P-Town, and she does cabaret in P-Town. But she was New York's very own for almost a century, and, and we love her greatly. Aww.